The top five play to earn NFT games for 2022. Actual good games. Jump in early. Hi everybody, and welcome back to the channel, where today I'm going to be talking to you about something that is only going to become bigger and bigger now that we're officially into 2022. Over the course of the last year, we had one heck of a year in the crypto space, from insane price spikes in Dogecoin and Shiba Inu, to the emergence of non-fungible tokens or NFTs, to all manner of other things that have drawn the eyes of the general public. Everyone wants a piece of the crypto market at the moment, but many aren't sure of the best way to start accumulating those tokens. Well, believe it or not, one of the hardest ways to get involved is to learn about and get involved in the latest thing that is letting people earn cryptocurrency by just playing video games. Sounds like a win, right? Well, here are the top five actual good games that you can start playing as soon as possible. So what are play to earn games? How are NFTs involved? And which are the best ones that can actually make you money? As always, I'll answer these questions in the next few minutes. So don't you go anywhere. And of course, subscribe to this channel, ring that bell for notifications, and make sure that you never miss out on any piece of NFT news that I've got for you that can make you some big bucks. Now, before we go on, I want you to remember that I'm not a financial advisor and that you must always keep in mind that there's risks to any investment. But with that said, and with your subscription all said and done, let's start to look at some of these games. But first, let's just go over exactly how this whole NFT thing works, because believe it or not, some people still don't understand it. That's okay though, because if you're one of those people who are just dipping their toes into the NFT space, I'm here to help you out. Non-fungible tokens have only just really taken off into the mainstream public's awareness. In essence, these tokens behave similarly to your standard single unit of any cryptocurrency, such as Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, Litecoin, even Bitcoin, in that they exist on the blockchain and can be exchanged and traded. But that's where the similarities die though, because unlike cryptocurrency units, non-fungible tokens are inherently the opposite. While a single unit of any currency in the world is fungible, meaning that it can be traded for another unit or combination of units that total the same amount, non-fungible tokens are one of a kind, custom tokens that can only exist once, a bit like you. Now, thanks to being tied to a smart contract, an NFT is authentic and infallibly probable as a genuine article. Imagine a work of art that's sold and needs a certificate of authenticity, or else it could just be a copy, right? NFTs are the same way. You can copy and copy the content of an NFT all you want, but it will never be the original, and the smart contract makes sure of that. Now, what exactly can be an NFT? Well, basically anything digital. A drawing, a painting, an animation, a piece of music, a sound clip, a video clip, even a domain name. But here's one that you probably haven't thought of yet. What about if video game in-game items could be NFTs? We've seen how much people would be willing to pay for customized character skins on games like Fortnite or Overwatch, but what if your skin was truly one of a kind? Imagine how much you could sell it for if it was an NFT, in a world where other NFTs sometimes net millions of dollars. Also, imagine if just playing the game could earn you cryptocurrencies and NFTs galore. I think you're just about up to speed now. And so then it's time to jump in and look at the five best play to earn NFT games that are actually worth playing. Number five, Project Quantum. Here's one anyone out there who likes Call of Duty should be salivating over. Now, many people have expressed interest in a play to earn first person shooter game like Call of Duty or Battlefield. And this is the one that looks like it will fit the position handily. One of the other things you'll notice straight away about this game is that it doesn't look like a trashy, overly colorful mobile game. No, sir. This is a AAA game, which means that it was produced in line with contemporary PC and console gaming standards and audience expectations. In short, this is a real game. Yep, that's right. This is a game that's going to allow players to engage in first-person shooter combat, but with a twist that they can also be able to earn actual cryptocurrency for playing it. Could this be the game that finally destroys Call of Duty forever? It's entirely possible, as millennials who love sitting around playing games and expect to make money for their trouble should flock to this one like birds flying south for the winter. Keep an eye on it and get involved as soon as you can if this interests you. Number 4. Star Atlas Okay, so maybe you're not into the Call of Duty style first person shooter games and you want to engage your brain in a bit more of an explorative experience, possibly set in space. Then look no further. For all of you Star Trek fans and No Man's Sky fans out there, the 10 that remain anyway, here's what you're looking for in your play to earn NFT gaming experience. Sure, you can explore throughout the stars, go to extraterrestrial bars and hang out, but then you can fly out and help to conquer space and take part in a political division of the galaxy. You can fly around different planets, join a faction, and have endless adventures in the universe-sized metaverse. Yeah, it sounds a bit like No Man's Sky, right? Well, even they got that right eventually, so there's definitely a way to avoid making those mistakes in this game. Plus, it looks absolutely gorgeous, and while there's not much chance of the demo footage representing the actual in-game experience, the game is going to pay you to have adventures in space. And who doesn't want that, right? Number 3. 
NFT Champions. Well, here's a game that looks a bit more like what you might expect from a game with NFT in the title, a cute creature battler. You know immediately what comparison is going to be drawn to this game. Yes, of course, it's Pokemon. Plenty of kids, and even a lot of adults, absolutely adore Pokemon and have absolutely no problem whatsoever with the format, even after 20 years. The genre lends itself instantly to an NFT game, with the opportunity to raise and battle an array of monsters, but with cash rewards, raids, PvP and live tournaments, in-game holding rewards, and regular NFT drops. It'll be out on phones as well as PCs, but here's the thing, the NFTs dropped on January 1st. You can go get one now. Go, 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 before it's too late. Number 2. Stormrite Alright, now here's a game from a genre that seems to be slowly dwindling and dying of late. Not for a lack of fans though. Stormrite is a medieval style fantasy RPG, that's role playing game, where you can play as an assassin or rogue, a mage or of course, a warrior. I love it because I'm a huge fan of games like The Witcher 3 and Skyrim. Imagine a game like that that pays you cryptocurrency for your efforts. I'm all in. You should be too. This game has beautiful graphics too and seems to run like a dream. I can't wait to try it and have medieval adventures while getting a piece of the action with NFTs and cryptocurrency going into my wallet, making me a little bit wealthier. Amazing. And number one, we've got The Sandbox. And so we're here with The Sandbox, a game that many of you probably already heard of, but one that definitely deserves its hype. This is a game that's going to be a fully realized metaverse. Yeah, I know that, that word again, metaverse, but this metaverse will exist and you can do, well, almost anything you want. This is going to allow you to even make your own games within the sandbox and you will not be required to know anything about coding or game development. That itself is a true achievement. Now here's the thing, you can buy some land in the sandbox, yes, land that you can then build a game and host it on your land or someone else's land, up to you and up to them. Then other players can play that game if they want to, and everyone involved gets paid a bit of cryptocurrency. In this case, the currency in question is called sand, which you might expect, and sand's price is definitely one to watch going forward. Of course, the game is also going to include more than just buying land and hosting mini games for other players, as you can customize your characters, travel the various different worlds, and see what's out there. You can build a home, customize it, a bit like The Sims, or maybe you can get a job, oh yes, a job in a game, that pays you with real cryptocurrency. You can be an architect, for example, and have other people pay you to design things in the game for them, like their house, or much, much more. You can really live in the game if you want to, though maybe you should consider your real world responsibilities first, as I know these things can be quite addictive. But there you go. Those were five of the most impressive looking, best designed and super exciting NFT based play to earn games that you need to keep your eye out for over the next little while. This isn't Candy Crush, guys. This is real gaming. But what do you think? Let me know in the comment section below which games you want to play or which ones you're just curious about. Also, of course, please do subscribe to this channel and ring that bell for notifications. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.